Hello, and welcome to the first chapter in our series of tutorials that will help you get familiar with using Corel's Photo Album 7. In today's short lesson, I'm going to show you how to get familiar with the layout and interface of Photo Album and help you maneuver around the various tabs. Photo Album is a fast, fun, and easy photo and video editing software that creates entertaining slideshows. You can add music, text, motion effects, and create great looking paper projects such as calendars and scrapbooks. Output can be to your printer, computer, CD, or DVD. You don't need to have any prior experience to create great productions you'll be proud to share with family and friends. Just a little creativity and imagination. Let me show you how this works. There are two ways to enter Photo Album. One is to jump right into the application. The other way is via this helpful Getting Started Wizard. Clicking any of these buttons on the left side will take you to an open file window where you can choose the image you want to work on, then you're taken to the appropriate place in the application for editing. For example, browsing for a photo using any of these search criteria will bring that photo or photos into the main window where you can start working on them. Tags are additional information that can be helpful in searching photos. They are added to the metadata of each photo. Although it's very easy to add these, and you can probably figure it out for yourself, I'll show you how to add these in a future tutorial. Calendar info can be added as an optional setting on your camera and can also be a search criteria. The Enhance tab over here shows the most common editing tools to use on your photos. Let's see what happens when I select Remove Red Eye. I'll locate the photo that needs this touching up. Notice that it opens in the correct area photo album with the Red Eye tool selected, ready for me to make an adjustment, which is exactly what I'll do. I will first zoom in to full size to make it a little easier on myself, and I just click once on each eye. I'll use the Alt key to resize it, click once on each eye, and I'm done. Excellent. Picture frame does the same process. I can choose from any of the huge selections of frames that come with Photo Album. And once I've chosen it, click OK to apply it. Wasn't that easy? Let's do some more. The Enhance and Create tabs are similar to the tabs of the same name in the main application. If I want to make a calendar page, I simply do the following. Go to the Create tab, click on Calendar, choose my photo, choose the month, choose the layout, and simply drag and drop my photograph into the area. And I'm done. Clicking the Import button allows you to import directly from your digital camera. It finds all your photographs and will automatically transfer them into a photo tray in Photo Album 7. Now, if we go into Photo Album's main window, you'll notice four main tabs. Home, Enhance, Show, and Create. These tabs, as opposed to searching in endless menus and submenus, are where you'll find all your tools. I'll cover each of these tabs in my next video tutorials, as well as integrating the more powerful PaintShop Pro Photo into your photo album editing. Thanks again, and have fun!